Hello, welcome to LabVIEW Pro. In this video, we'll learn about how to create an array without using indexing. Both while loop and for loop are able to produce an array using the indexing. For example, we have the indicator in the front panel and a simple for loop in the block diagram. So when we run it, it has produced 10 elements array using the indexing. But sometimes we may not want to produce an array using the indexing. So let's uh, add a code. First of all, we have a for loop. And now what we'll do is we'll create initialize an array because we want to be using the indexing and numeric constant and change that to the boolean values. Uh, change that to the double value just like the top one. And at the moment I will change that to 10, it doesn't matter. So we'll connect over there and then we'll replace that with C register because we want to be using the indexing in this case. Let's generate the random number just like the previous code. Now what we'll do is we'll build an array using the build array function. But what we'll do is we'll build the array of the elements that are only less than 80% or 0.8. After the comparison, we'll use the case structure. And the case structure will hold the code that will that will build an array if and only if the value produced by the random number is less than 0.8. So if it is true, then we'll connect that just like as shown over there. And that will be the value to be build array with. And when it is false, that is greater than or equal to 0.8, the data in the array will not be changed. So that value will be our array. Required value, since we're not using the indexing, change that to the last value. And if we'll do the create indicator, now this will be our non-index value without indexing. Now let's push it probably to compare. Now this is how the value will be produced, the array will be produced without indexing. So if we see, whenever the value is greater than the value of 0 0.8, the array element is not updated. And when the value is less than 0 0.8, the case structure goes to the true case and the value is being updated. So we have got nine elements in this case. This is how we create an array without indexing. 